Alright, here we go. Hello, this is CB Ultra 768, and we are back with Metal Wolf Chaos XD. And last time we went to Chicago and saved it from being poisoned by Rick. Oh, by, uh, I was about to call him Richter Cox, but I mean Dick Cox Poison Gas. So we saved Chicago, and then we went to Texas where we took out a base and also a one of uh, Dick Cox's giant uh, warships. So now we're going to Miami Beach to destroy the command cruiser, and then we gotta go to New York. So without further ado, let's go. The enemy force sends out over 1,000 citizens a day from Miami, trafficking them into overseas white slavery. Oh my. The command cruiser moored on the coast directs troops to the Atlantic. It has long-range, high-powered missiles on board. Stay on constant guard. Okay. Many helicopters join the defense. Concentrate your attacks on intercepting these cannonballs. The objective is the destruction of all target areas and the command cruiser. Okay. This mission goes by the call name. Let's hear it. A lovely and clear sea once more. Good okay. luck and Godspeed, Mr. President. And as you can see, I've been upgrading my weapons. Like, I got two... I got a missile launcher and bazooka together, a shotgun and an assault rifle, two miniguns, and the railgun I've been using is not that bad, actually. Takes time to recharge, but if you make your shots hit, it does so much damage. I'm really liking railguns so far. Hey! Oh, there are mines. Okay, Enemy gotta be careful of that. Miami Beach. That battle Love this music in the game. Directing the Atlantic Ocean troops in this area. My God. Attack the cruiser and the Kudadal forces, leisurely enjoying their holiday. And huh. sink them to the bottom of this grand ocean. Okay. For their sakes, I hope they enjoyed their last R&R. &R. Jesus. The Navy cruiser will fire pellets in long range. You'll need constant Okay. 
ไThis is annoying. Having to freaking make sure you don't fall in. Come on, lock on. It was something like to lock on to, wasn't it? I might have to move shit. There we go. Come on. Stop jumping. There. 
again, there's a problem of I gotta get out of here. I gotta get across the water. Wait a minute. Okay, we're safe. I was say, I thought I had to jump from boat to boat, but I'm fine with that. Alright, let's get in a better position. Let's get to the fight. Oh my god. Again, that's the thing that kind of sucks. That if you die, you have to start everything all over again. Like, Jesus. Uh, uh, ow! Get a little closer. Yes! Fire! Alright, didn't take it out, but good hit. Fire! Okay. Woo. So far, the only annoying thing about this mission was the water. Rawr! <laughs> Eagle of the Atlantic. <gasps> Our catchphrase. Now. Oh. who survived. <laughs> Where are you going, Mr. President? Oh, God, I can't believe that part. I was taking care of horses and I just fall in the water. I was like, no! Ah. But whatever, at least we made it. Again, we got most of the hostages. Just gotta find probably one more hostage and one more energy pod and then that's it. So we did pretty good on that level. All right. The sinking of Hawk. Oh, sorry. I keep saying Hawk. It's Cock. The sinking of Cock's command cruiser dealt a crushing blow to his Atlantic Marine forces and put an end to his heinous trafficking of American citizens out of Miami. As for the sunken cruiser, it became a rich ecosystem that teems with marine life, including a new species of coral, which I am sure you have heard of. Scientists named it Sea Forester in honor of. Brigade General Robert Forrester. The missteps that ended his life bear remembering. Let his tragedy never be repeated. DNA correspondent Peter McDonald. What's the pulse of the nation say? So basically, he was Michael Wilson's commanding officer, but he had no idea that he was in the suit, and Michael had no choice but to take him out because he was standing in his way to get to Dick Cock who's taking over America. Citizens have already begun to wake up to the vice president's evil intentions. Good. They couldn't stage a revolt in time. Just the thought of a revolt is enough. I'll take back the nation soon. Full speed ahead. <laughs> I'm with you all the way, Mr. President. All right. Now it's time for New York. There we go. Oh my. Before taking the huge weapons head on, destroy the energy supply facilities. The objective is the destruction of all target areas and the massive arms. Okay. This mission goes by the call name. Give it to me. Hopefully they don't bottomless pit. Operation Relog NYC. Good luck eh. and Godspeed, Mr. President. Alright. But yeah, as you saw, the railgun is actually really good. That actually helped me take out the ship a bit faster. Uh, 
Even so, I didn't even need to jump to those boats. The Enemy boats, I realized. Those City. are just for to get the hostages. Are with an oh god. Oh, uh, the spy dust. Alright. <laughs> what? Dick cock! Richard, Dead. what do you think of my <laughs> cute little pet? Thanks to him, Pretty ugly. the people of New York City are right Ian, don't now cross those hostages. Uh, running around and trying to escape. <laughs> uh, it's like a big old carnival. It's like Mardi Gras in New York or something. <laughs> Why do you guys keep comparing it to a carnival? It's a giant spider. From its super energy wave phaser, it'll get you high enough to reach... Or I guess a bug, since it has six Richard! legs. <laughs> goodbye, goodbye, goodbye. <laughs> goodbye. <laughs> he says hello, hello, hello. Goodbye, goodbye, goodbye. Alright, please, I need to move. I need to get the hostages now. Hostages. What he said is true. This will be dangerous. There you go. Run away for now, Mr. President. That's what I was waiting on. Ah! Oh! They hurt! Why? Each target area obtains powerful electromagnetic I'm trying. I'm working on shit right now. Oh, Jesus. Get out of the way! The bastard. You could give me a warning, like, hey, watch out. He's about to fire. Like, I don't know when this thing's gonna shoot. A musician was among the POWs you rescued. Once again, there will be music playing in the background. Fuck! I was. Like that fucking laser! Okay, let's go! That was horseshit, man. Like, you begin the mission, then all of a sudden, boom, 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 boom. He blasts you immediately. It's like, Jesus, what dude. What said is true. This will be dangerous. Run away for now, Mr. President. Jump! Ah! That is... Get away from me. Oh, my God. This is bullshit. I can't move. Jesus Christ, dude. Ah! Well, I'm dead. Holy fuck! Alright, don't go for the hostages. I need to run. I, I don't know. This is... Bullshit! Like, what the fuck? Like, I'm trying to get the hostages, then all of a sudden, boom, 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 boom! He fucking blasts me into the goddamn laser. I mean, what the fuck was that? That is horseshit, man. Alright, so I, I guess I gotta keep moving now. I can't just stay in one place. I gotta go, go, go. Fucking blow up! Are you kidding me? I'm blasting it with rockets! Jesus Christ! It takes so fucking long for something. How close is he? Well, I'll say, I gotta check to see if he's close now. What the fuck? Is he here? I was like, what the fuck is hitting me? Oh my god, there's even more of them. Oh my god! 
Where is he? Where that lake? Oh my god, he's right there. Run, run, run. I'd love to get the hostages, but I can't! Holy fuck! Like, will I not be able to do this mission now? This is horseshit, man! I keep trying to run and get to his things, but damn! Sorry I'm getting so angry, but fuck! This is not fun! Having to run away! God, it takes so long to blow these up. Come on, get to work. God, he's right there. God, he's right there. I need to get behind him. Run past him. Fuck you! I was not near that! Fuck you, game! Get in here! <laughs> God, this is frustrating. Especially since you gotta run around and like avoid him just to get to the target. Really?
almost hit. Get behind him. by myself, I'd be going back to get those hostages at the beginning, but I just want to get through this mission. I'll have to try to do that by myself. But I mean, it just sucks, because if you try to go for the hostages at the beginning, bam, he blasts you with that laser, and it's like, Jesus. Oh, fuck you. Ah. Where am I? I guess we can go down. I need to find... Oh my god. I need to get out of there. Jesus Christ. If I could at least stay behind this building and destroy it, I'm fine with that. Oh my god, that laser. Please blow up. Thank you. Oh my god, this mission is so nerve-wracking. Especially my health now. Set. Oh. Oh. Destroy the energy fill station in town before doing anything else. 
close is he getting? He's getting pretty close, shit! close, but that was the last thing. Alright. I'll be back. I hope, uh, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna just destroy all of them, then we're gonna just get to the spider boss fight. Hopefully he doesn't fuck me up as soon as I destroy them. So, hang on! Uh, yeah, uh, he kind of messed up. Uh, apparently... I didn't need to take out all the energy things. Uh, turned out I could have just killed the spider whenever I wanted. Because at one point I was destroying targets and I, uh, I was using my railgun and I realized his health, like, went to half. I was like, huh? And I'm like, charged it up one more time and shot him. Again, it probably helped because I took out some of the targets, but... Yeah, I guess I could have fought the spider whenever I wanted to. Uh, well, shit. Well, after this cutscene, I'm assuming there's gonna be a cutscene. I'll, I'll record uh when I defeat the spider because I want you guys don't want you guys to miss that. So hang on. Oh, uh, again, sorry about that. Oh my god. Because again, I thought it was like, oh, you gotta destroy. Everything. No, it turned out you just destroy enough until you feel okay. I can damage this thing now. If I knew that, I would have freaking just took out a few of them and then went, okay, get him. Jesus. Anyway, having having a busted Cox army from nearly every corner of America, President Wilson set a course for the tyrant's last bastion, Washington D.C. and the White House. The president had no idea of the cowardly trap Cock had laid in store for him and his team for Air on Air Force One. DNN correspondent Peter McDonald. The enemy's course of the East also started with drawings. Did they? <laughs> Did they? <laughs> I wonder, are we near the end of the game? It sure has been a long road to victory. Yes, it has. All that remains is your home. The White House. Mr. President, huh. when this battle is over, I'm taking a paid vacation. I haven't seen my parents for a while, and you know how it is. That's fine with me. <laughs> you deserve some extra time off, too. Hmm, I can't wait. Last stop, Washington, D.C. I wonder, is this really the last stop? Yes, Mr. President. I guess we'll see. The information management department just contacted me. The coup d'etat forces are making an announcement on national television. Oh, let's hear it. Dear fellow Americans, good oh, evening. Oh, the volume ain't bad. So yeah, the this update is worked. The last time, the government these were loud as hell. Where the password is, no more Metal Wolf. No. Metal Wolf who escaped from military custody through metal. cruel trickery, continues to agitate various parts of the country. Sympathizers to these acts appear to be on the rise. As an American, this is most regrettable. Please try to remember the names and faces of any of the ringleaders who instigated this terrorism. A heart of justice is a heart that loves America. Okay. Surrender now while your crimes are still not so serious. But if you refuse surrender, based on Article 48, Clause 4 in the newly enacted U.S. Constitution, Metal Wolf sympathizers and or any blood relatives removed four times or less, as well as schoolmates in all educational institutions, such as high schools and universities, as well as 
any co-workers or associates, or any and all related people, a public execution will be carried out. <laughs> so, Jesus. to any terrorist sympathizers, if an ounce of oh, justice geez, still up, remains sorry. in you, sorry about those give lines, up on damn. that man and surrender by well, 5 actually, p.m. today. That's actually on the TV. This is our final ultimatum. Sure this has been that. an announcement from the Government Policy Promotion Department, where the password is, We Love Richard Hawk. <laughs> Man, you guys sure do love some dick and cock. Jody Crawford and the other members of the President's team had abandoned him. Richard Dick Cox, despicable, manu manuring, maneuvering, had left them no choice. It would be unfair to brand them traitors. They were forced to back away from what was right to protect the people they loved. All the same, the president was alone, and the man who did it to him had come to rub salt in his wound. DNN correspondent Peter McDonald. Oh boy. <laughs> Great. Richard. Dick. Or Michael. Left all by your lonesome. Richard. What? What? Changed you, <laughs> Michael. Money has gotten too fat for her own good. These incapable pigs are eating this nation alive. Ah. The death of these freeloaders, leaving only the capable behind, will help me create a new nation. Richard, you. Oh, and Michael, I forgot to tell you, your presidential staff, those backstabbing idiots. Well, I've decided they can die too. <laughs> you. <laughs> you. If you want to help those pigs, come to Liberty Island and watch those worms wiggle in vain. <laughs> see you when I see you. Great. Richard! <laughs> so yeah, I wonder, is this going to be the last level or not? Maybe. Actually, probably not. This is probably, like, second to last. Alright, uh, so, let me show you the, uh, ending with the fight with the spider. Here it is. Ultra POWER! Alright, yeah, that's all there is to it. Alright, well, I hope you all guys enjoyed. This has been CB Auto 768, and we'll be back with more Metal Wolf Chaos next time, so stay tuned for that. Bye bye.